In a world where power speaks often through the thunderous booms of aerial bombings, it's time we pause and reflect. The recent strikes by the Biden administration on Iranian-backed militia targets in Iraq and Syria have sparked a heated debate. Are these retaliatory strikes truly an effective deterrent? Digging deeper, we unearth a history of unsuccessful U.S. strikes against Iranian proxies, a testament to a strategy that seems to be hitting a dead end rather than a solution. The echoes of these strikes reverberate, sending ripples that could potentially trigger a wider regional conflict. And let's not forget the war in Gaza, a key piece in this intricate puzzle of conflict. Addressing this underlying issue is not just crucial, it's imperative. What type of conflict are we really engaging in? It's a question that demands a clear understanding. It's a question that calls for a comprehensive plan, one that goes beyond the smoke and the rubble to address the ongoing regional conflagration. The Biden administration stands at the crossroads of difficult choices. A delicate balance of strategic objectives and containment of conflict is required. The stakes are high, the decisions monumental. It's a checkmate situation where every move could tip the scales. In the chessboard of international politics, the game is far from over. The question remains, are bombing strikes really the right message we want to send?